Place your fingers for me. Got really warm hands, you. you must get that from me. Well, having normal core temperature and good circulation is not really a hereditary condition. Oh, well, I stand corrected then. Besides, it's usually more relative if someone has even slightly cold hands than you, then they'll say that you feel warm. Yeah, well, I didn't think of it that way. You know your stuff, don't you? I just basic common sense, really. Yeah, if you're a complete brain box. Um, okay. So what, what about there's any more discomfort there? No. No. And what about there? Yeah, a bit. Well, your cut seems to be healing nicely. Oh, sorry. News? Yeah, yeah, um, Aidan, he's out of surgery and doing well. Well, you must be relieved. Yeah, I am. And so were you two close then? Of course, yeah, he's family. As you get to know me again, you'll realise that family means everything to me. <sighs> At least just tell me how long he's staying in Weatherfield. Placement's four months. <clears throat> Is there anything else I can help you with today? Oh, tell us I know. Well, have a nice afternoon. Thanks for your time, Dr. Neeson. Anytime. Something that can be an admirable quality. Well, she might have got that from me. There are worse traits a child can inherit from a parent. Except I've never been a proper parent to her. And yet, here you are, feeling a pride in a daughter that only a parent could possibly understand. Thanks, mate. Gratitude's not necessary. Simply stating a fact. Even so, I'm sorry about earlier. Truth is, I'm a bit jealous of your relationship with Carla. I know it's daft, but she has some major love for you. The, the extent of her affection for me is born out of a shared experience. There's more to it than that, and you know it. Well, be that as it may, to see our relationship as a threat is foolishness. I will always endeavour to offer Carla friendship and honest counsel should the need arise, but that is where my role in her life ends and yours, if I might be so presumptuous, begins. He's out of surgery. How did it go? Were there any complications? None whatsoever. Went like a dream according to the doctors. <sighs> one down, one to go. They said we can see him. What are we waiting for? <laughs> he looks so peaceful. For him to do this, to give Carl such a gift. I know. And he didn't even hesitate. <laughs> Not for a second. He's amazing. Mm. You know what makes me most proud, though? It's the fact that over the last few weeks, I've seen Aiden finally become the man I always knew he could be. If he can do something like this, then he can achieve absolutely anything. And when he wakes up, I expect you to tell him exactly that. Ah, don't be soft. <laughs> Your brother knows how I feel. I just thought you'd want to know Carl is in recovery and awake. Ah, uh, thanks, love. 